Hi everybody, welcome to Homestead Tessie. everyone, and welcome to another Thrifty Thursday. And today was another good day. I'm so glad you enjoy my Thrifty Thursdays. And I decided to see if I could bring the camera up a lot closer so you're able to see really in detail what I got. So let's get started and dig in my bag. Woohoo! As you know, I'm on this vintage kick right now, and it seems like everything I find is vintage. I'm trying to find my receipt because I spent $5.15, I think. It was it was five dollars and some change. So the first thing I got for a dollar was glass cookie stamps. Now, I bet you're wondering what I'm going to use these for. They have a little handle and they have pretty little flower indentations. You use it for to make cookies. There's a heart. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to use these when I make my homemade soup. I'm thinking I could press this into my homemade soap and make pretty designs. I do not know if it's vintage. It sure looks vintage to me, but there is no date. So I got these for $1. I got a coffee candle for 99 cents, and it has the coffees on the outside, and I thought that's a pretty good deal for it because it is brand new. And then I got for 35 cents the Country Gardener's Cookbook. Now it is like a pamphlet for the gardener who likes to cook. So it's 35 cents and 1974. So I'm guessing it's vintage. <laughs> if this is vintage, then I guess I'm vintage because I was born in 1970. So the Garden Cookbook. So it's really another one that I really like. And a lot of times when I buy these, I end up giving these as gifts when I give gifts away. So I don't always keep all of them, but I always enjoy looking at them and copying some of the recipes. And for 35 cents, you can't go wrong with that. Then I got two of these. And they actually had four, but I didn't have enough money this time. So if they have them, maybe next week I'll get the other two. They were a dollar each, and they're not vintage. They're to look vintage, but... Yes, they're not vintage, but I'm going to make candles with these. And I have an upcoming candle video coming out. And then for 25 cents, I got these Kerr lids. These were the small lids to go on jars. I do not think they no longer sell. I would love to know if they sell them. They're number 63 lids, but I collect them. I love the old look, and I use them as decorations. And so for 25 cents, I got them. And the last thing I got was a jar. Got another one of these jars, mason jars for 25 cents. You know, it may be only like one here and there, but in the course of a year, it really does add up. And it doesn't smell like there was a candle in it, but sometimes you can buy candles in these mason jars. And you know what? It's the same jar, so you can can with it. So I thought that was a really good deal for 25 cents and I just add that to my jars and after a while it makes a big difference. So I cannot find my receipt, but I spent $1, 2, 3, 99, that's 4, 50. Yeah, about five dollars and some odd cents. So I really want to thank you guys for watching and enjoying my 50 Thursdays and they're so much fun. So I got the jar and I got the candle. And I got these. So I'm hoping this works. So I've, I'm going to be really excited to give it a try. And to see if I can make neat soaps with it. They're, they're cute. I'd like to see if I can maybe find some different ones. It said made by Williams and Simona. And that's not vintage. At least not that I know of. But So thank you again so much for watching. And I hope you're having a really good week. Because I am. And I have a lot of videos to share with you in the next coming week here that I'm working on. Lots of canning, lots of cooking, lots of changes in my life. So I'm really excited to share with you a new journey that I'm on. And I'm taking you along with me. And we're going for a ride together. And who knows where the end of this journey will lead us. Take care, everyone. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.
I just want to say thank you so much for watching my videos. If you like this video, could you do me a favor? Could you share it? Thanks again, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.